okay now we do that first of all go to side view right click on vertex mode move that one up align your vertex move it down that one down straight then front okay go to the perspective view check your image move it a little bit up little back and that one little back move okay three to smooth mode check it out go to side view again align these vertex press six or the shaded mode move this vertex here that one there little bit down okay press 4 and go to the perspective view now we do that and just these vertex that one little bit there okay now go to the edit mesh split polygon tool now we take some edges from here to there for the nose areas and the mouth areas click there there that one there and the last one there press enter now now we take another edge loop there go to the side view adjust that one words Again, in perspective view, edit mesh and uh, insert edge loop tool. Press it there. Okay. Now go to again edit mesh and split polygon tool. Take this edge there. Vertex mode, move it a little bit there, inside, and move that one again. Go to the edit mesh, select split polygon tool, take another loop there for the 
Eccoci. Go to the side view. Shaded mode. Move these vertex a little bit up. These vertex on the nose. Move that one there. These words were nostrils. Go to adjust our mouth areas. Okay, now adjust. That vertex on the lips. Move that one there. This will be there. Move these two vertex to this place. Okay, now we will adjust this one loop. these two vertex there for chin go to the edit mesh and split polygon tool click there the last one here side view adjust it at the nose area Faces or nose, and that for the lips. You, you see that there is a triangle, and in the start of lesson, I had told you that triangle creates problem during UV texturing and the blend shapes. First we have to remove this triangle, edit mesh, edit mesh and uh, split polygon tool, split these faces. Go to the front view. Shaded mode. Shading and disable the X-ray mode. Move 
is what is written there and I just that what is and uh, that one will be there again in perspective view and delete that one edge and uh, that is go to side view wow adjusting our loops next lesson we will attach these edges and do more work